Hi, I'm Walter from EVs Enhanced, and today we're sitting in a 2016 Nissan Leaf. It's a Japanese import, and it's the top spec G model, uh, which means that it has the Nissan Connect head unit, which has been giving people uh, grief in terms of setting the clock. On the 2016 S model, the, the base model, setting the clock is really trivial. That's just done through the instrument cluster in one of the menus. And on the earlier versions of the Leaf with the uh, Nissan Carwings head unit, the, uh, setting the clock was uh, able to be done much more easily through a not-so-secret service menu um, that is in the head unit. The 2016, well, the late 2015 through to 2017 cars with this Nissan Connect head unit have been a bit more uh, of a headache for people. There have been a few uh, solutions uh, to set the clock that haven't really worked very well. Um, probably the main one being disconnecting the GPS antenna, uh, taking the battery terminal off the, the 12 volt battery and resetting that at 12 o'clock. But that did have some issues, uh, does have some issues, uh, particularly with the charge timers and the car not working. On this car here we've got the clock correctly set and We've got working charge timers. You can see that the clock is, is also set down here correctly. Um, but that's not actually what we're here to discuss today. Uh, today we're here to discuss our instrument cluster conversion tool. We've been doing instrument cluster conversions into English for quite some time now. But up until now we needed to get to the car or the car needed to get to us. So this tool is about eliminating that need and making the whole conversion a whole lot easier for everyone. So I'll go ahead and, and demonstrate uh, how, that, how that works. This tool supports everything from uh, the 2011 model year cars through to 2017. I'll just scroll through the Japanese menu screens just to show people what it's like before the conversion. Obviously a lot of this doesn't mean much to people without the help of Google Translate. And now we'll go ahead and convert it all to English. I'll plug our tool into the diagnostics port. And it's just a case of pressing the blue button to start the conversion. So here we are in English. I might just point out that in the 2016-17 X or G it does have clock in here but that clock is just for setting 12 hour time or 24 hour time on the upper display. The setting of the actual clock time is is still done through the Nissan Connect head unit. On these later cars you also have the driver assist functions for forward emergency braking and lane departure warning. And the other thing that's uh, not really shown here is all the warnings that pop up in Japanese uh, to, to tell you things uh, are all obviously going to be in English now and including when you turn the car off The status of the charging timer, climate timer, um, are, are all here, and in English as well. This tool will be shipping out to our partners scattered all throughout New Zealand. If you're looking for one of our partners to perform this conversion for you, or if there's no one in your area that can do the work and you're looking to become one of our partners, then feel free to get in touch with us. Thanks for watching EVs Enhanced.